when uh, the 80, 88, 89 cricket season starts, I'm going to be walking straight through those gates to playing it again. When the popular all-rounder made that statement back in November last year, not even he realised how prophetic it would be. The triumphant 24-year-old had just been diagnosed as suffering lymphoma, a form of cancer. Twelve long weeks of heartbreaking chemotherapy lay ahead. It was a bleak Christmas for the O'Donnells and those closest to them. Increase in pay, Pete, look. <laughs> Take a look at Simon O'Donnell today, and it's no wonder he's been selected in the 12 to represent Australia against Pakistan in Perth on Monday. Just try and keep him out of the side. You know, I wanted to play cricket and I was going to. And now, whether that was up the bush or you know, in a local suburban league or district cricket or shield cricket or test or one-day cricket again, I wasn't sure. O'Donnell attributes much of his remarkable comeback to the tireless support of his friends and family. The illness may have passed, but its memory lingers. You know, it's a good thing to, even now to be able to look back and laugh about it. Mm -hmm. Is that what you do, look back and laugh? Yeah, uh, yeah I'm, not, I'm a bit probably scared to laugh, um, but... I mean, you just try and forget it, and uh, if you can look at it in a jovial sense, I think it makes it a little bit easier. O'Donnell is looking forward now, not backward. And even after accomplishing so much this year, for him, it's still not enough. Well, I'm just going to you know, work my butt off from now on in and probably train harder than I have trained so far and, and make sure, hopefully, that I can stay there. Christopher Hill, National 9 News.